your girl Gladys, aka Zachua Hair, and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm here with a new unit from Sensational. It is their Dashley 8 unit, and I have her in the Money Piece Hazel color. The Dashley unit does come with your typical cap construction with two combs here in the front, a comb in the back with adjustable straps. It also comes with a, I would say maybe like a five inch parting space. Let me give you a quick 360 of the unit. So let's get into the pros of the Dash 8 unit. First pro would definitely be this color. I really like how Sensational blended this, um, I would say it's like a number two, almost number four, into the Money Piece Hazel. That was a great job. I love the dark rooting. It looks like the dark rooting is throughout the unit. Kudos to Sensational for that. I also really like the parting space. I think the way it came looks super natural. All I had to do was just add my got to be glue and let it dry a little bit. I add my pressed powder, the Maybelline Fit Me powder in the color 360. I also used the 355 and I was good to go. I really like the style of this unit. I think it's a classic, um, I, I really like the style of this unit. I think it's a classic, like loose body waves. It looks super pretty. Another pro to this unit I think is a cap size. I would say it's on the big head friendly side. I have my my unit on the tightest setting and it is not reaching all the way down to my hairline, but I'm sure that if I had it on a looser setting, it would. So I think it would accommodate a larger head if it was maybe like 23 inches or so. As far as cons, I will say there is quite a bit of tangling and shedding that I'm getting as I've been brushing her out. But you have to keep in mind, this unit is advertised as a fast fashion unit. So literally you are buying this for the look. And I think I'm giving y'all a look right now. And you're buying it because it's a look at a very affordable price. This unit costs, with, for the Money Piece Hazel color, it costs $26. And if you got it in like a natural 1B or 2 color, it would be $22. So you guys, it's a very cheap unit. I don't really expect too much when the unit is at a cheap price point like this. It's doing similar tangling that the Outre Phoenix unit was giving me. With that unit, I don't really care for my color choice, but at least I like this color choice a lot better. So that makes the tangling that I'm getting a little bit more bearable. So it's up to you. If you are super bothered by tangling in your units, you might wanna pass up on this one because this one is gonna give you a lot of tangling. I can already tell. I've been brushing it out at the bottom. Oh. <laughs> It's cause you know, I noticed it was doing its thing. But it's synthetic and it's really cheap. So I think it is a cute unit for the price point. I think that if you are looking for a unit that's going to slay you instantly with very little work, you're trying to be a baddie on a budget, this is definitely the unit to get. And for this color blend, I mean, I'm really not mad. I think it's very, very pretty, especially on my brown skin tone. Lately, I've been feeling like the 30 color, the blonde 30 color has been like blending in with me, but I think this looks really good. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. So yeah, I like the color, I like the cap, I like the parting, um, the tingling shedding, slightly annoying, but I can work with it because I already know what I'm getting into when I get this type of unit. I'm just gonna put this right back in the pack after this review <laughs> until I decide to wear her again. A unit like this is probably not gonna last you but only a few wears before it starts really tangle up badly and there are ways to alleviate some of that tangling i know i've mentioned my girl chandism 101 who steams her units that's a great way to revive synthetic wigs also you have to remember that because it's synthetic and it's rubbing against fabrics you know it's winter time we're wearing sweaters and cottons and wools that is like the nemesis to <laughs> synthetic wigs like those type of materials so this sweater i have on right here this synthetic hair rubbing against this for a full, you know, day, maybe at work or something. Oh my God, my unit would be so tangly by the end of the eight hours. You just gotta keep that in mind too when you wear synthetic wigs. The materials of your clothing also make a difference. That's kind of why I like wearing, you know, longer synthetic wigs like this during warmer months where I have like less clothing. Like if I just had this on because I know it's brushing more up against my skin, which in turn will, will yield less tangling. That's just something to keep in mind. What you wear at different seasons make a difference in the longevity of your wig, synthetic wig. Yeah, let me know how you feel about Dashie 8 in the comments down below. How do you feel about this color? Would you get her in this Money Piece Hazel color? I, I think she's super, super pretty and super affordable. So, you know, for under $30, 
It's like, why not try her out for the color? I'm not trying to dye some 613 bundles, honey brown. Are you? <laughs> so let me know how you feel. And if you are new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. And don't forget to tap the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. We are on our way to 6K and I'm super excited about it. So let's keep it going. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Oh, baby. Oh, baby.